Shalom. I want to first start off giving all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh. Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rakak Kadash. Dub on us to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, the men that taught us this truth through the Spirit, and peace and blessings unto the elect of the nation of Israel. This is the brother Abadia from the GMS Houston camp. And I'm back with another lesson. And I got a couple of scriptures to go into. And I want to get uh, straight into it. Uh, before I do, I like to say, you know, I hope this um, video is edifying and exhorting to our spirits. So I have right here Philippians chapter 3, verse 14. And this is uh, the, the, out of the mouth of the Apostle Paul. It says, I press towards the mark. And what's the mark? The mark is um, the end to finish uh, and make it to the end, which is at the end of this, at the end of the road, so to speak, of doing the work in the ministry is salvation. Okay. It's I press towards the mark for the prize. And what's the prize? The prize is uh, salvation and, and the kingdom. Okay? Because through the salvation, we get um, all the blessings, you know, that the kingdom's going to, that the kingdom's going to uh, bring or that being in rulership and righteousness is going to bring. Because the Israelites, we are the, we are the kingdom. Okay? Us ruling in uh, righteousness. All right. And what is that going to do? That's going to um, have us to receive all the promises. Or in other words, the blessings. From the Heavenly Father. We read it again. I press towards the mark for the prize. Of the high calling. So what's going to get get us to the mark and. Uh, the, the, the prize to receive the prize. Is um, ultimately just being of the elect, you know, being of the elect, but the elect is going to do what? The elect is going to do what uh, 2 Peter 1 and 10 says, which is um, give our diligence to make, you know, our calling and election uh, sure. For if we do these things, we, sh we should uh, never uh, fall, I believe it says fail. I'm, you know, roughly paraphrasing. And right here it says, of the high calling of Yahweh in Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. So, you know, we in this ministry, it's a high calling because why? Because we were called into this ministry by Yahweh Shai. That's in, um, what is that scripture? St. John 15 and, 15 and 16, I believe. Let's see. Right, I'll read it real quick. St. John uh, 15 and 16, it says, You have not chosen me, but I have chosen you and ordained you that you should go and bring forth fruit and that your fruit should remain, that whatsoever ye shall ask of the Father in my name, he may give it you. So that choosing is, a, uh, is also a calling. Let me look up this word choose or chosen. I'm sorry. That being chosen is what is the uh, is the calling. But I want to look up the the word, see what the Greek word is. Strong's G fifteen eighty six. Eklegomai. Eklegomai. All right. Thayer's so lexicon. Eklego. Eklego. All right. So this is for the word chosen. Let me make sure. Salaki, give me one quick second. Yes. All right, so this is for the word chosen in St. John 15 and 16. It says to be picked out, choose, to pick or choose out of uh, or out for oneself, 
choosing out of many. Yeah, because for like in the, uh, I'll give you a uh, an example when uh, if you playing a pickup game of basketball and the uh, the person that's choosing the teams, the two guys uh, that's choosing the teams, they're uh, they're picking out uh, players to come play on their team out of different uh, or many many different uh people that's out there to, that want to play right and what do they got to do they got they really call this they call them to come play um on their on the, on their team you know i got him that's the, uh, the it's another way of you choose somebody you really you call them too now let's go back to the philippians 3 and 14 so this is not any old calling you know that we've been you know how we've been called into this ministry you know it's not like a thing of um it's not a this it's it's a high calling meaning a calling from the from the spiritual realm and the next scripture is gonna uh the spiritual realm meaning from our lord yahweh shai because the scripture I just read said, you don't choose, you have not chosen me, but I have chosen you or called you. The scriptures also say, for many are called, but few are chosen. Okay. So this high calling is a calling, is not a calling from this earth. Like, like a, a man on this planet earth can see potential in a, for an example, uh, a kid out there playing football and be like, man, I think that kid got something or that, you know, a kid mean goat, you know, but I'm, you know, you know what I mean? Uh, or a baby, a baby goat. Okay. And so I see something in that, in that, uh, in that boy, you know, I want to take him up under my wing and, um, you know, build them up and, and whether it be football, basketball, b boxing, you know, I see something in them. And then what he do is he would, what he do is he start, he tell them, Hey, you know, I'm a, you could, you could be great one day, you know, uh, um, if you let me, uh, work, work with you. So that's, that's, that, uh, that's a uh, calling that that boy was called like, um, a chosen by you know by a man on this earth to to uh do something man he may have already been into it but then you know the man called him and, or chose him and said man i'm gonna try to make you know make this boy great i see something in him so this is this is not something of the other of this earth you know and the way you know and the way we know that This was a high calling, a calling beyond, cause you got you got uh beyond this earth, is because you got, oh even dealing with the the, the scriptures you got preachers, so called preachers you know pastors or whatever, and they they're pastors because their granddaddy was, their dad was, so they feel like you know they feel like my calling is to be, uh, um. A preacher like my like my dad and my my granddaddy, you know. And you know they go and spit spew out that Christianity garbage. But to show you that you know this is a high calling, we see that you know the the people can't get this. You gotta be uh, chosen by the Yahweh Bashim Yahushai to get this truth. There's no other way. And the, and the way we know is because we didn't from the apostles and the elders on down then broke these scriptures down. I mean, plain as day. We didn't see different times, you know, from the apostles on down. When we was out on the highways and byways or even doing these lessons, breaking, break down, breaking down the scriptures crystal clear. And, and, you know, Jake just can't get it. But there are a few that do get it because the uh, 
you got to get this from your how by Shimei I will shy. All right. All right. Last scripture. And I'm going to end this uh, video. This is uh, Hebrews three and one. It says, wherefore, this is Paul again. It says, wherefore, holy brethren. Partakers of the heavenly calling. Right, this is something when we all understand this, you know, we all understand that only by the power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, uh, uh, we were able to understand or believe and then start to understand uh, this truth, these scriptures. You know, just based on what I, I just said a minute ago, it's, it's, you know, just like when we came into the truth. We thought, man, it was so easy for us to get it because it was so easy for us to get it. We understood it. You know, we didn't have to go. Yeah, we had to go, you know, check and do our research on what we was hearing. Right. But we, we believe. And it was like, man, this makes sense. It's easy to understand. Oh, the scriptures talk about, you know, make make uh, in the book of Habakkuk, the second chapter. You know, make make this uh, plain upon tables that he that read it may uh may run or he that may run that read it, read it. it. So uh, the prophet's job is to make uh the this the dark sense, the parables, the, the break down the prophecies, make it uh simple when in the breakdown. OK, and we thought. And we all thought like this, you know, damn, I got it. I understood this so easy. You know, it makes perfect sense that when we go and we went and shouting out to our family and friends and all that, and they just couldn't get it. And the reason why is because the calling came from uh, on high. You know, the call, the calling, this us believing was the calling. <coughs> Salakia from Yahweh by Shimei Awashai. Okay, and that's the point, you know, that I want to stress in this video was that you know we was called, we know that we was called into this um, to the faith of believing in these scriptures through the Spirit and power beyond this earth from the Heavenly Father and His through His Son. Okay, based on what I just said. It is not hard. This is not a hard thing to understand. It's very simple. But if you're not called, you're not going to get it. You know, and we hope to be chosen. You know, we hope to be of the chosen. Of course, but we know for sure we were called if you're teaching the correct doctrine, you know, still to this to this day and having uh, took taking breaks, you know. Let me finish the verse. It says, Consider the apostle and high priest of our profession, Mashiach Yahweh Shai. And with that, I'm going to close out. You now, Lord willing, this video once again was edifying. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory once again to Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai, Bahasham Rakakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, the men that taught us this truth through the Spirit, and peace and blessings unto the elect of the nation of Israel and Shalom.